identity theft happens. Don't be a victim. Identity theft happens. It's an unfortunate fact of modern life. But there are certain steps you can take to help keep your personal information from falling into the wrong hands. Every day you do things to protect what's most important to you. And you know what? You do them almost automatically. Routine things like looking both ways before you cross, brushing your teeth, and buckling your seatbelt. Another routine to get into is keeping tabs on your identity and personal information. Here are five easy ways you can do it. Read your credit card and bank statements carefully and often. Know your payment due dates. If a bill doesn't show up when you expect it, look into it. Read the statements from your health insurance plan. Make sure the claims paid match the care you got. Shred any documents with personal and financial information. Review each of your three credit reports at least once a year. It's easy and it's free. And before you know it, protecting your personal information can be as routine as locking your doors at night. What if you become a victim of identity theft? What to do if you are a victim of identity theft? If your identity has been stolen, the FTC is the right place to learn how to set things straight. Here are three steps to take. First, call one of the nationwide credit reporting companies. Ask them to put a fraud alert on your credit report. This means businesses must confirm that you are you before they extend credit in your name. The alert is a roadblock in the path of an identity thief, and it's just one phone call away. Second, order free copies of your credit report from each of the nationwide credit reporting companies. Third, complete the complaint form at ftc.gov slash complaint. This creates an identity theft affidavit, which helps you file a police report. Keep records of your calls and copies of your documents. You'll use them later on. For more tips and tools on dealing with identity theft, visit ftc.gov slash ID theft. That's ftc.gov slash ID theft. Just because identity theft happens doesn't mean you have to be a victim. This message is brought to you courtesy of the Princeton Police Department and the Federal Trade Commission.